Hey, what's up? Welcome back. I think you guys are gonna like this one. I certainly do. So this is an Icon FJ. Specifically, it is an FJ40. It is number 140. And it started life as a beat to hell, half a million mile 1969 FJ40. That was really beyond salvation from a conventional restoration approach. Yet we've still managed to breathe new life into it. We painted it in one of my personal favorite colors, which is a contemporary Audi color known as Nardo Grey. Should I have done a German accent? Doesn't seem like it. They probably stole it from Ferrari anyway. So anyway, that is what it is. Obviously the roof cap and the front bib uh, reference the original FJ40 colors. This truck was built as a bikini top as well as with the full removable hard top. So I took it out last week and took some pretty pictures to share with you guys with the bikini. They were quite popular on Instagram. So this being a new school edition, of course it has the icon, new school, front and rear bumper set up. So that rear bumper has the tire carrier. It has been modified and we have deleted the jerry can carrier, which makes for easier access to the rear cargo and seating area with the hard top. And when the top comes off, this is running ambi doors or ambulance doors instead of the lift gate tailgate configuration, which means the client has no doors on the rear, no tailgate when the top is off, but he's totally cool with that. And so am I, as long as he is. For wheels, although it's a new school truck, we are running the old school Icon wheels, this time finished in the Icon Minitex Black, which is the same finish you'll see throughout. Other trim details like the roll cage and the seat hardware and the center console and the dash panels and the like. For the audio system, we're running the latest iteration of the 8200 NEX head unit, which now has wireless or tethered CarPlay. This truck set up with the navigation, the higher end amplifier with the Focal K2 audio speakers with separates and remotes, along with amp and bass. And did I mention the reverse camera? Because it has one. For seating, this is the jump seat configuration in the rear and the usual bucket configuration in the front. The buckets are set up with the three-stage carbon fiber heat elements. And you will notice this does not run the usual Chilowich. Client selected the custom interior option. So we did a really nice sort of charcoal gray leather with almost like a new buck texture or tone to it that I'm really happy with. You'll notice we did custom door panels with matte pockets that were designed in the same material. Um, referencing the original FJ40 door panel, but just kind of upgraded subtly. Still the stock window regulator and door straps and manual windows. Uh, what else? We have the Icon Fire Extinguisher. We have the Icon Sport Brakes. Of course, we have our super nifty Learjet visors. For the headliner, because it's new school, we did more of a modern setup there. So we did the black or deep charcoal Alcantara synthetic suede, uh, which is just really nice. Windows are all tinted. We use the 3M tint. It's a film. It's not in the laminate. Unfortunately, up to today, that cannot be done because nobody makes reproduction FJ curved glass for the hard top rear corners. What else am I missing? I feel like I'm going too quick today. I got a lot on my plate. ARB locking diffs, the sport suspension, tunable from Fox Racing, um, Hydro Boost assist on the Icon Brembo brakes, of course, tunable suede bars. Ah, we'll call that good enough and we will thank you for your time. I appreciate you as ever taking the time to watch these videos and get to know the brand on a more intimate basis. Any questions, you can call us, 818-280-3333. Facebook is Jonathan Ward or Icon4x4, and Instagram is Icon4x4. Be well, and we'll see you on the next one.